Hello Year 9 and welcome to today's drama lesson. Lesson Outcomes What? Write a script piece based on knee highs Hansel and Gretel. Why? To demonstrate your understanding of the characters Hansel and Gretel. Retrieval Practice Number 1. What is Hansel like? Number 2. What is Gretel like? Number 3. Who wrote Nehi's adaptation of Hansel and Gretel. Pause the video here to write your answers. And here are the answers. Number one, Hansel is very clever and tries to trick the witch. Two, Gretel is very good at making contraptions. And number three, Carl Gross wrote Nehi's adaptation of Hansel and Gretel. Here is a synopsis of Nehi's Hansel and Gretel. The story is set in medieval Germany. Hansel and Gretel are the children of a poor woodcutter. When a famine settles over the land, the woodcutter's wife, stepmother to Hansel and Gretel, decides to take the children into the woods and leave them there to fend for themselves, so she and her husband will not starve to death. The woodcutter opposes the plan but finally reluctantly submits to his wife's scheme, unaware that Hansel and Gretel have overheard them. After the parents have gone to bed, Hansel sneaks out of the house and gathers as many white pebbles as he can, then returns to his room, reassuring Gretel that God will not forsake them. The next day, the family walks deep into the woods and Hansel lays a trail of white pebbles. Their father lights a fire for them in the woods and goes to gather more wood. After a while, the kids realise the father isn't coming back. Gretel cries, but Hansel tells her all will be fine. After nightfall, they follow her shiny pebbles back to the house, arriving by morning. Their father is overjoyed and takes them back in, as he was very upset about leaving them in the first place. After a while, famine strikes again, and the stepmother insists that they take the kids back to the forest to leave them. This time, she locks the door to their room so Hansel is unable to gather pebbles. Clever Hansel crumbles up the small piece of bread he is given by his parents and sprinkles crumbs along the path. Unfortunately, birds eat the crumbs and they can't find their way home. After searching for a very long time, they come upon a house in the woods made of bread, cakes and sugar. They eat from the house as they are very hungry. While they are eating, a witch comes out and invites them inside, offering them a meal and pretending to be a kind and friendly old woman. After feeding them, she traps them in her house and makes them do chores each day, feeding them well in order to fatten them up for eating. One day, the witch decides it's time to eat and has Gretel light the oven and provide water for boiling her brother. After a while, the witch asks Gretel to hop in the oven to make sure it is hot enough to bake bread. Gretel is sensing the witch's intent, pretends she does not understand what the witch means. Infuriated, the witch hops into the oven herself to demonstrate what she wants, and Gretel pushes the door closed behind her, leaving the ungodly creature to be burned to ashes. Gretel frees Hansel from the cage, and the pair discover a vase full of treasures and precious stones. Putting the jewels into their clothing, the children set off for home. They arrive home to hear that the stepmother has died from unknown causes and their father has not had a happy day since they left their home. They live happily ever after with the witch's wealth. Task. Answer the following questions, showing your understanding of the play. Number one, what period and place is the play set? Number two, what job does Hansel and Gretel's father do? Three, why does the father and stepmother leave Hansel and Gretel in the woods? Number four, how do Hansel and Gretel find their way back home? Number five, what does the stepmother do to make sure that the children can't find their way back home a second time? Number six, how does the witch die? And number seven, what items do the children take from the witch before returning home? Pause the video here and answer the questions in full sentences. 
Your second task. Considering your knowledge and understanding of Carl Gross's characters, Hansel and Gretel, write a new scene which shows their reunion with their father. In your script, you must think about and include number one, how the father reacts to them returning home. Number two, their reaction to the news that the stepmother has died. Number three, the children's recounting what happened to them to their father. Number four, include a scene description outlining where the scene takes place, what furniture is in the scene and what props the characters may have. And number five, include stage directions to show how you wish your performance to use their vocal and physical skills. Once you've completed your work, upload to show my homework. If you have any questions about this work, please email nicola.herrell at clf.uk. Thank you. Bye-bye.